This past March, my husband was arrested for attempting to extort a bar owner for $40,000. The SWAT team raided our home. They were able to recover the fake FBI badge that he bought for himself, the handcuffs and the Glock that he had on him. We were having monetary problems. We were responsible for the rent at the dojo and our mortgage. And then he purchased two cars without consulting me. A few years back, he actually took out a $30,000 loan to purchase DJ equipment so that he could do DJ gigs. I didn't realize at that point that this was only the tip of the iceberg and the beginning of his path to, to destruction. Well, police claim that Dallas Michaels romantically proposed to his mistress with a beautiful diamond ring while he was still married to his wife, Teresa. But what was he allegedly willing to do in order to marry his new fiance? Police allege they uncovered a deadly plot to get rid of the wife he already had. Take a look. After the arrest, I found out that Dallas was leading a double life. In February of 2020, he proposed to another woman while married to me. He used my credit card to purchase this engagement ring for his fiance. He had several Facebook accounts and he blocked me from all but one of them. He actually posted messages on the one that he was friends with his fiance on, making an announcement about the engagement, pictures of them, pictures of the ring. I communicated with the fiance, I sent her a text message, found out a lot of information. We exposed a lot of the lies that he had told both of us. He told my kids to call her mom. And she said, no, 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 that's not necessary because they, they have a mother. And he said, you know, she's not really like a mother because she's not in the picture. Dallas told this other woman that I was bipolar, doing drugs in front of the kids, and that I was beating my children. I was studying for my master's degree. And he told me that he was gonna take the kids out to give me some alone time to be able to, to do my assignments. And little did I know that he was actually taking them to see his fiance. I had no idea he was leading a completely different life. Over Easter weekend, he was insistent that I take a vacation without him. This is also for you as a present for completing your fourth college degree. He was insistent that I go somewhere out of state so that I was out of the picture so that he could have some time to clean the house and empty out my drawers to make it look like I don't live here so that he could have his fiance stay in my home for a few nights. She stayed at home with my kids and slept in my bed. So hindsight, I was too naive to realize what was going on. He was lying to me the whole time, but I truly do believe that if I had pressed the issue, he would have killed me. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.